This is the most amazing brewing technology in the world. Wait until the apples mature on a large scale. Hose them down. The apples are then sent to the factory via conveyor belts. During this period, the machine will rinse the apples three times. The grooves in the conveyor belt can filter out impurities very well. Next, the apples are sent to the grinder. The grater inside the machine shreds them into pulp, then send the apple pulp to the juicer. The huge pressure will cause all the juice in the apple to flow out. At this point, workers will collect them. Sent to another machine for more fine filtration and pressing, the roller applies pressure to squeeze out the juice. Juice dripping from the hole in the belt, this process filters out most of the apple flesh, but some still exist. At this point, they need to be put into a larger collector. Sent to roller machine through water pump, the apple pulp and juice are passed through a rotating drum. Strain out more pulp cores and apple stems. The apple juice flows through the holes in the drum into the collector below. Next, they will be sent to the heating tank. Not only can it be sterilized, and the yeast that makes wine converts the natural sugars in apple juice into alcohol. Wait until the cider takes shape. Will be filled directly into the empty bottle through the machine can. Then continue through the assembly line and enter the packaging area. The machine will first put a lid on them. Each cap is then tightened by rotating the roller. Next is the cooling step. Wait until the temperature drops and put the label on it. At this point, all processes of making cider have been completed. Do you want to try its taste?